Hello all, welcome to AC Electronics. In today's video, we are going to see five different recruitment opportunities from four different companies. So there is actually two recruitment opportunities from Google. One is from Cognizant, one is from Amazon and Deloitte. So these are the companies that we are going to see in today's video. There is actually a lot of opportunities for uh, people with basic graduation and no experience is required. There is permanent work from home, job opportunities. There are very exciting other news. Also, in this video, I'll be sharing with you a very useful information. So please do watch this video till the end. Also, if you are seeing the channel for the first time, please consider subscribing to the channel and follow us on our Instagram page. So let's see the recruitment opportunities one by one. The first recruitment we are going to see is from Google itself. So they are hiring for an apprentice or um, apprenticeship role. Okay. So here, uh, if you are from a non-tech background, this is a golden opportunity to work with a company like Google because whenever they are hiring for non-tech uh, categories, they will put the requirement as any graduate or any graduation is eligible. Especially the recruitments, there are two recruitments that we are going to see here is uh, for people with a basic degree in any discipline. Okay, so let's see the details. Let's see the first recruitment, which is from Google, that is for digital marketing apprenticeship. Okay, so this is an apprentice recruitment. It is going to be a 12 month program, but after the apprenticeship, uh, you will be absorbed in the company if your performance is good during this 12 months. Okay, this is February 2023 start very clearly. They have given the deadline also. Generally, uh, it is hard to find the deadlines, especially when it comes to IT companies or uh, private companies they don't really put uh, deadlines but here very clearly they have given the closing date of this application is on October 27th so you can only apply till October 27th after that it is not possible to apply so please apply for it uh, when you're seeing the video after that first see the video completely then please apply for it okay so here there are not just one there is not just one location there is multiple locations Hyderabad is there uh, Telangana is there, Gurgaon is there, Mumbai, Maharashtra, these are the locations. Okay, so for multiple locations, they are hiring for apprentice. Now, what is the uh, educational requirement or what is the minimum qualification? Let's have a look. They have given bachelor degree in any field is preferred. So the uh, title is digital marketing apprentice. So your work is digital marketing. Okay, so whatever product uh, Google is uh, designing, you are going to work on the marketing side. It is a purely non-tech job. So people with basic graduation or basic degree in any field is eligible. Maximum one year relevant experience in digital marketing. Very clearly they have given maximum one year of experience. It is not minimum, it is maximum. Means they are very much uh, expecting freshers. But if you are having up to one year of experience, you can apply. But beyond that, if you are having two year or three year of experience, you are not eligible to work here. Experience working with computers, basic understanding of computer, handling of computer. Then the most important thing is language. Speak and write English fluently. These are the minimum qualifications. Now we can see on the screen as well. Also, they have given some other preferred qualification, but we cannot or uh, we don't need to really look into that. Uh, whenever a company is uh, conducting a recruitment, they'll be first uh, putting the minimum qualification. So if you are having those qualification or if you at least made the 50 percentage of that, you should definitely apply. Okay, so for this uh, apprenticeship, people with basic graduation with any year of pass out is eligible. Okay. Talking about the work location, even though they have given multiple locations, you can also opt for work from home. Okay, so that is the first title or first role, which is for digital marketing apprenticeship. The second one is a similar kind. Uh, here, they have given data analytics or data analytics apprenticeship. Now, what is the job of data analytics person? He is going to uh, analyze the data. It is again a non-coding job. Okay. Here also the uh, closing date of application is 27th of October. Qualification requirement is almost the same. It is actually the same. Bachelor degree in any field, maximum one year of relevant experience, but here it is in data analytics field. Experience working with computers and language uh, knowledge or language requirement. Okay, so this is the basic qualifications. If you are having these qualification, please apply for it. 
and you'll be getting a stipend. You can work with the company for 12 months for an apprenticeship program. And if you're performing uh, good in the program, you will be considered for a full time job. Okay, so that is going to be the case. So these are the two recruitment opportunities from Google. Now, next, we are going to see a recruitment opportunity from Cocktails. And before that, I want to share with you a very useful information. So before moving to the next recruitment update, I want to share with you a very useful information. Uh, about Jobathon 14, which is a hiring challenge conducted by Geeks for Geeks. So uh, we know that when it comes to very much useful courses or uh, these type of free hiring challenges or free coding challenges, Geeks for Geeks platform is a very uh, excellent platform to explore always. So there is a uh, Jobathon uh, 14 or there is a hiring challenge, which is called Jobathon 14 that is happening on 21st uh, October from 8 p.m. to 10.30 p.m. So there is four companies which are hiring through this uh, Jobathon 14. That is Service Sparrow, uh, Lotus Soul, Hot Wax Commerce and, and uh, InfoGlen. So these four companies are hiring through this uh, hiring challenge which is called Jobathon 14. And for this uh, hiring challenge, there is four parts. There is three DSA questions uh, consisting of 100 marks, five MCQ programming logic questions uh, are for 25 marks, five MCQ questions, on logical reasoning again for 25 marks, five MCQ questions on quantitative aptitude again for 25 marks. So you will get a very good uh, uh, understanding of uh, what is going to be the uh, the uh, the test pattern of uh, various MNCs because all the MNCs or unicorns or IT companies, they uh, conduct the test or their uh, uh, entrance test uh, for their recruitments with the same pattern almost. So you will get a very good exposure to the uh, test or you can get a mock test and also you will get a golden opportunity to get hired by these four companies. So these are the uh, this, these are the four parts of this Jobathon 14 hiring uh, challenge. Now there is option to select uh, language for your DSA questions. C++, Java, Python, these are the three options available. Okay. So please take part in this Jobathon 14 hiring challenge, which is a golden opportunity to find a job and also to get a very good exposure of the test pattern of various companies. So please make use of it. Just go to the link in description and participate on uh, Jobathon 14, which is happening on October 21st. The next recruitment we are going to see is from the very famous company Cognizant. and a lot of people are looking forward uh, uh, or they are expecting recruitment opportunities from Cognizant because I get a lot of comments uh, below all my videos to bring more and more recruitment opportunities on Cognizant. So they are conducting a very uh, latest recruitment opportunity or uh, there is a latest recruitment opportunity which is actually an off-campus hiring that is called Cognizant Infra Off-Campus Hiring for Graduate Trainee and Engineering Trainee. Okay. So if you are having minimum three months of experience to a maximum of 12 months of experience, means three months to 12 months of experience, if you are having, you can definitely apply for this. Now, if you are, uh, if you have previously done some internships or some apprentice trainings or uh, any experience, if you are having for minimum of three months, you can definitely apply for this uh, off-campus drive from Cognizant. There is two categories of recruitments happening for people from non-tech background or you can say non-engineering background and for people from engineering background. Okay, so that uh, the two categories are graduate trainee and engineering trainee. Graduate trainee means if you are having any three-year graduation that can be BSc, BCom uh, or BBA or BCA. So all the, you can say all non-engineering streams are eligible for that uh, graduate trainee recruitment. Okay, uh, here salary offered is 2.52 lakhs per annum the second category of recruitments is happening for engineer trainee here the salary is 4.01 lakhs per annum and people from b b tech m e m tech m c a m s c m s any domain very clearly they have given any stream is eligible whether it is civil mechanical automobile chemical biotechnology biochemical whatever stream you are belonging to you can apply here okay so these are the two categories of recruitments happening now, the percentage requirement is the most exciting part uh, of this recruitment. You need to only have 50 percentage uh, in your 10th, 12th diploma, but no standing arrears. So previously, when I put a video on cognizant recruitment saying that there is only 50 percentage requirement, some people commented below that video that it is not true. But in this notification, very clearly, you can see and also on the screen, you can see that only 
50 percentage is required. These two companies like Cognizant and Capgemini, uh, they have uh, recru uh, recruitment opportunities in which only 50 percentage is the cutoff criteria. Okay. And one more thing, maximum three year gap is allowed. And year of pass out is 2019 or above, means 2019, 20, 21 and 22. Okay, so these are the uh, basic requirements. If you are having this, please apply for it. So that is a very big recruitment opportunity from Cognizant. Minimum three months of experience if you are having, you can always try for this recruitment opportunity. The next recruitment we are going to see is from Amazon. Again, a permanent work from, op uh, work from home opportunity from Amazon for Associate Catalog. So they have given the title as Associate Catalog Work From Home. Now, what you are going to do in this role is, uh, we know that Amazon is a very big marketplace. Uh, they are having various categories of products. There are uh, some furniture, there are uh, beauty products, various n number of categories is there. So you are going to work on the catalog of various categories. Every product is having various uh, contents or description, uh, their features and everything. So you are going to take care of the catalog of these categories or products. Okay. You are going to maintain the content. You are going to uh, make some changes if it is required. So that is going to be the role of a person associate catalog. And talking about the location here, it is permanently work from home. You don't have to relocate. You don't have to travel to any place from your home itself. You can work. The requirement is also very simple. Bachelor degree in any discipline. Again, a non-coding job, non-tech job. So you can, uh, you can be a person from any discipline bachelor degree basic bachelor degree is the only requirement zero to two years of experience strong written and verbal communication skill is needed your communication skill is the most important uh, factor or skill when you're applying for a non-coding job okay mostly so that is a recruitment opportunity from amazon now the last recruitment we are going to see is from deloitte it is a recruitment opportunity which is active from a long period of time it is for customer support analyst GTLO. Hyderabad, Telangana is the location. It is still active. Technical requirements is any graduate with 0 to 1 year of experience, customer service uh, experience or knowledge in phone, chat, email support. Language is very, very important when it comes to a customer support related job. So your spoken English language proficiency really matters. Microsoft Office. Uh, proficiency is also required if you are having experience uh, in service now it is preferred otherwise also you can apply so that is the last recruitment we are seeing in today's video we have seen five different recruitment opportunities uh, mostly uh, these recruitment opportunities are applicable for people with basic graduation a lot of people uh, from bcom streams or bsc or bba uh, from non-engineering streams are also following the channel for job updates. So if you are finding uh, job opportunities like this, which are for uh, non-coding jobs, please make use of it. Please go to the link in description and apply for it. So that's all for today's video. I'm really hoping that you found the content useful. If yes, please consider subscribing to the channel. You can share the video with your friends. You can suggest them to subscribe. Thanks for watching and keep on watching.